I'm going to go get a little closer to that. It's not too far away. It's about 20 kilometres away. We'll see what's going on here. Yeah, you can see the sort of shape there of a classic uh, mesocyclone forming. Can't really see any um, rotation in it though. May just be scud and fractus. Anyway, quickly drive uh, along the Murray Valley Highway towards that. I'm on the Golden Valley Highway now. Yeah, we should be able to get a bit closer to that and see the other bit that's to the left. I can actually see a funnel cloud on the left, like that lowering, the main lowering that I showed you earlier, to the left of that. It's about 20 kilometres away, exactly to my right. Hopefully it lasts long enough for um, me to get some pictures. The uh, good thing is that uh, the steering winds will steer that through areas that are not populated very much. So it should go somewhere between Strathmerton and Namurka. There is a chance it could hit Namurka. I certainly hope not if it is a tornado. Ah, uh, oh, that's a good looking funnel cloud. I can't say for sure if it's a tornado touchdown, but that is a good funnel cloud. really need to get much closer. I'm sorry if I don't have focus there. Certainly lasting a while, the shape of the cloud, which is a little unusual. Looks to be losing some of its funnel shape there. It may just be a massive amount of uh, scud. But we do have the right kind of weather set up to produce a small tornado, perhaps. We're in the right area. Whatever it appears, it doesn't actually be appearing to touch the ground. What it, uh, sorry, whatever it is, it doesn't appear to be touching the ground. Close. The interesting thing is how well it's holding its shape and for how long. Though it, the tip of it does keep changing. I think that may, may well be a, a funnel cloud actually, trying to touch the ground. Funnel cloud is a tornado that has not touched the ground, for anyone wondering. It's not officially a tornado until it does touch the ground. I think it's a lot further away than I anticipated. There is a wall cloud extending out to the right from it. So I'm facing south at the moment. There's a, um, a wall cloud extends out of this to the northwest. So this, this does have all the right things, I guess. going to cross the uh, Golden Valley Highway somewhere between Shepparton and Amurka, perhaps even Shepparton. We're losing light rapidly now. Oh yes, this has um, definitely got like a big donut around it of a wall cloud. It's sort of taking a small mothership kind of shape. Plenty of lightning starting to become visible now that the uh, sunlight's dropping. Flash.
keep it focused. A lot of lightning out the front of it. It's going to get going in a minute. The very least, try and get some good shots of the lightning, I suppose. Very nice. No tornado, though. Actually got a bit of rain starting here now and a good thunderstorm coming up behind me. So that ended that photographic session. The video will have to do now. It's one hell of a good thunderstorm. Anyway, start heading home now, I guess. Some thunderstorms back there by now, I'd say. Only likely to be lightning, though. Oh, that was a good one, damn. Shame I missed that. Some good lightning forming behind me. Let's wait for these few more cars coming to go past, and I'm going to head back home and look at that. There's actually some good lightning on the way home. In fact, it looks like that thunderstorm that we're looking at now is joining up with the one behind me. Oh, yeah, this thing's making some good lightning now. Jeez, I hope I didn't just knock the focus. Looks like we're going to be core punching this one, whether I like it or not. Woo!
big CG then. Geez, I really don't want to core punch this. There's not really much I can do though. Oh, some of that's nasty. There's really nothing I can do. Oh, this is going to be scary. This is highly electrical, this uh, cell. And uh, I don't know these roads that well, only the main road that I'm on and the one that goes to the left and right very soon. I'm just hoping I can get up in front of this, but these are actually moving very fast. It's, oh, there's some debris on the road. It's not a good sign. Oh, geez, hopefully there's no hail. Due for a CG any second. There's one out to the right. Some cloud to cloud almost above me. I need to uh, turn right as soon as possible to get out the way of this thing. Unfortunately, I'll have my back to it then, which is not much good for the camera. Damn cars. Okay, I can see the road, but geez, this thing's travelling at probably damn near 100 k an hour towards me. Oh, highly unlike. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Where we got here? Oh, no, here I am at the main road. Awesome. Whoa, 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 whoa. Luckily, lucky that thing is uh, highly electrical. I wouldn't want to be core punching it. I'm very close to it, crikey. Wish I knew someone who lived here so I could stand under their patio or something. Just get up the road 5k or so and I'll uh, pull over and we'll get some video or some still shots or something. Probably some still shots I would prefer. basically all forming into a long line now associated with the coal front it's all actually I think on the coal front there's a very perfectly shaped cold front it's shaped like a wave reaches over the top of the warm air it's quite strong so the warm air is really bunched up into it and then pushed up through the overlapping cold air quite classic really quite clean cut all the cells appear to be sort of joining up into a long line. Some huge flashes behind me. I looked over my shoulder there while the camera was off and um, saw a huge CG, still closer than I would want to be. So I'm going to go to Strathmerton and try and um, capture from there there's shelter at Strathmerton and
this is getting so good now I thought I'd get some video for a bit we're about 30k south of the Murray River Back to the still shots, I think. It's getting quite exciting here. The wind's building. Sounds like we've got some small amount of hail inside the rain. Thunder's getting quite loud. Lightning is uh, sort of pulsing. I think even under this shelter I'm still going to get wet so I might uh, pack up to the car I think oh well I got some good shots and good video time to go home Going through the town of Yarrawaya. The Yarrawaya Roadhouse.
Certainly not quite as electrical up here as it was just uh, when we were back south there at Strathmerton. Got news for you, they're here now. Also, in the snowy mountains of the ACC, a cold front will move across southeast New South Wales overnight. Damaging winds down from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour, and winds from 20 to 30 kilometres per hour. Win
Holy cow. Whoa. Oh my god. Oh, I've got very strong winds here. Damn it, this is a bit scary then. Whoa. I'm only 5k out of Finlay. Jesus. Really wanted to get home before this hit. Our home's not exactly what you'd call storm proof. You can see the lights of Finley ahead, no doubt. These winds are so strong, I'm slowing right down as we pass oncoming traffic. I've got to get out and close the gate, damn it. I wonder what Kirst's doing. He's probably worried about where I've been. Oops, sorry puppy. Hopefully I haven't stuffed up the focus. Wow, well, our roof's gonna flood. There's nothing we can do about it. We're probably going to have something like 20 millimetres in 15 minutes. I hope that's the end of the rain. Well, I can't believe how electrical this thing is. Never seen anything like it in Finlay since we lived here. Seen it plenty of other places before, just, oh, that's a good one not in Finlay. Good on you. Go on, go chase it, you twit.
No, he won't. He'll try and chase it and he'll run away. He, he would. He, he'd, try and, he'd run for kilometres, thinking he's, it's right there, not realising that it's actually far away. Not realising the thunderstorm's actually moving away from him at actually a very fast speed. So I remember when we lived at Drysdale at the house, him bolting down the stairs, <laughs> like he's going to run after it, try and catch the lightning or something. Twitters. <laughs> Come on, you're scaring Tesla. Stop it. Shut up. Do you want to turn the kitchen light off? Just so it's all dark in here, so we see all the flashes. We've had tens of thousands of lightning strikes. That was a nice bright one. Can't wait for the rain to stop a little bit so I can get some still photos. This seems like the bulk of the lightning's to the north and south of Finlay. Finlay itself seems to have mostly gone untouched with lightning. As usual. Well, the strong winds certainly failed to materialise very much. Whoa, that's a good one. Shut up. Whoa, there's a ripper. The rain's nearly stopped. Shut up. Have you noticed he makes a noise every time I speak? See, there he goes. <laughs> Are you talking about it too, puppy? I think he's trying to say, quick, Dad, it's getting away. We've got to go chase it. more minutes I'll go out out the front and get some still shots. 